Hi, and welcome back to my channel. This is Suzette Phillips, and today I am coming to you because I want to have a conversation. Um, I want to talk about the collaborations. I've been up, I've been, I've been in tears all morning. So if you see tears streaming down my eyes, then um, just know that uh, they're good tears. I got up this morning and I went outside and I stood out there on the porch and I just began to really thank God because we made it. I don't know if you all know that, um, I don't know if all of you all know, but I know some of you all know who did um, watch the video that our air condition was out. And we went through this whole summer without air. And so I've been in tears, so grateful, just so grateful that we made it through. And it was a hot summer, but we made it through. I will not complain. I really want to talk about the collaborations. I said that I wasn't going to be doing any more uh, collaborations. And I mean it for right now from the bottom of my heart. And I'm not saying it because I think that I'm bigger, better than anybody else. That's not, that's not what I'm here for. I'm saying it because what you don't know is during the times of collaborations, it was hot. For uh, Grandma Sandy's um, collaborations with the um, fairy garden, I had to do those videos over so many times. And it got to the place I was out there in the heat. And so I said, well, let me go in. But when I went in, it wasn't coming into no air. The heat inside was worse than the heat outside. So I did the videos anyway. And I put them up. And then I had other videos that I was doing, like the Alzheimer's. I did that. And um, this is the part that you don't know. I would have to get up early in the morning. The video times would be 7 Eastern time. And I would have to get up at 6 o'clock because I would have done my video. And I would make, wake my granddaughter up because she told me she was going to help me do the videos. And so when I had to list the different links, everyone's name, and add myself to the playlist, I didn't know how to do that. Well, thank God for uh, Thrift Queen because she did videos on it. But at the time she did the videos, every time she would do it, I would be on I would be on the uh, live with her, but. Something would happen and I would miss everything that she was saying. And then when I went back to look for the videos, they weren't there. So um, I um, would get my granddaughter up. And y'all know that was the time of the pandemic. We would go to a gas station and sit in a parking lot. So that she, I would transfer my video to her phone so that she could add the links and add me to the playlist. Now we kept doing, we had the children with us and we did this almost every time, almost every time I was uploading a video because I wanted to participate. I wanted to be in the videos. I didn't want to slight one for another. So we would go up there. Um, to this gas station and sit up there. Why? Because if the Wi-Fi wasn't working here in the house, and I'm going to tell you the crazy things that was happening. Like we literally sat out on the porch and saw where the wire popped and started sparking. And so we didn't have Wi-Fi. Then there was another incident where somebody ran into the pole knocked the wires down, we didn't have Wi-Fi. No internet service, no Wi-Fi. Then they're building up in this area. So when they were building, you know, sometimes the power would just go out. 
And so, um, you know, there's just the times that we was going through it. And those people would be out there working, even though, you know, everybody was told to stay in. Those people would be out there working on those poles, trying to get things together. So I looked at my granddaughter and I told her, I said, you know what? I'm just going to stop doing the uh, collaborations because it's too much. And then when um, it started coming out for the YouTube etiquette and I would start reading, you know, through YouTube. And I was like, I don't, I said, I don't see anything, you know, about the etiquette. I said, but I don't want to be disrespectful to YouTube. I want to do what they telling me to do. So I told her, I said, I think I'm going to just have to stop. But I didn't stop. I kept doing videos, kept getting out there in that house, son, kept doing videos. And so the last one that I did was um, Marilyn Fabulous Design on a Budget in July when she had her, uh, she does her colors every month. And this color was red, white, and blue. So I did the video and we got in the car and we drove down there. And when I got ready to send the video over to my granddaughter, I deleted the video. Y'all know that hurt me so bad. And we came back and I set the table up again. And I looked at her and she looked at me and I said, you know what? I said, it's it. I said, I'm just not, I'm, I can't keep putting y'all through this. I can't keep going through this. I want you to know I was physically, mentally, spiritually, and emotionally drained. Not just because of the collaborations, but the heat. The heat had the most of me. And I said, I wasn't going to put my family through it no more. So even though I'm getting all this new equipment, I, I, I think I'm still going to give collaborations a rest. And um, my spirit is trying to come back to a place where it should be. I don't feel nervous in my stomach no more. I don't feel sick, dizzy, like I want to pass out and faint. And I can't take a lot of sun in my head because of uh, the tumors that I did have that they took out. I can't take like a lot of heat in my head. So I was really going through some stuff, but I kept trying to push and kept trying to try to do these collaborations. So I am here today to let every young lady know when you're doing those collaborations, I'm going to sit, I'm going to watch, I'm going to support. Even after all this happened, some of the ladies that I was in collaborations with, their names don't even pop up on my phone anymore. So I said, I'm not going to get... And I'm not going to get in no kind of a way about it. I don't know if they moved themselves. I don't know if they deleted themselves. Um, I don't know if they're just not popping up. I don't know what's going on. But I said I kept feeling like I need to let you all know why I'm no longer doing collaborations. And I had conversations with my sisters and had conversations with my niece. And they all was like, just do you. So, y'all. Please accept me for who I am and let me just do me. I'm still not going to be doing videos every day because I'm still trying to come back. I'm still trying to come back. But this morning I got up and I cried so today because it was a cool day and I enjoyed it. I'm grateful for it. So that's what I wanted to share with you all. I hope that you receive it. Because it's coming from my heart. It's coming from my heart. So I just want to say thank you subscribers. Thank you new subscribers that's coming. Thank you for those of you all that come and view. And most of all, thank you so much for those of you all who leave such beautiful, beautiful comments. And I just want to give you my last four letters. S-L-C-S. -S, subscribe, like, comment, and share. And yes, to all of my new and old subscribers, thank you so much. I appreciate you. I'm so grateful. I'm grateful for you. I really am. And I just want to tell you, thank you, thank you, thank you. God bless now. Much love.